Um, this one, you guys might like this one. So if I load up cartridge and console, this was a fun one. So back through here, uh, this was just all Z modeler and it's fairly simple to put forward. I mean, these aren't real complex shapes. Uh, the cartridge itself is also fairly simple, um, but if I go into polyframe mode here, let's go ahead and do a merge visible. This is just basic Z modeler stuff. So uh, instead of figuring out how to resolve all this, I just went through an array mesh, put those in, and then just basic Z modeler shapes for these shapes. And then I did, again, instead of trying to resolve cutting this out and then putting a little sticker in there and cutting this out and making it resolve correctly, um, I just quickly went through and just divided these things up, array mesh those out. And, uh, and then now I have a little separate sticker piece in here that has a little extra material ID. So if I turn on my material IDs, it'll be nice and clean. And then on the drone itself, I'll go ahead and load that up. Go to the back here where that kind of plugs in. Here it is. So back in here, let's hit F to frame. Uh, you can see inside here, we've got the cartridge. This is a little proxy just kind of stuffed in there. Uh, but these cords in here were done the exact same way. You know, these little cords that kind of spread out. And the only reason, I don't wouldn't normally spend this much time but since we had the camera right here, uh, I went ahead and put in these little things here and little cords that go and stick back into the little thing in here. So if we turn off this cartridge, you can see that actually goes in and go right in there and then little buttons work and stuff like that. 